In my mind, one of the most important things that we need to do in doing equity work is to have the voices of the people that we're trying to impact at the table. You know, in this field, people use terms uh, of equity, diversity, inclusion, equality, cultural competency, very much interchangeably. And these terms all mean very different things. Equality, of course, is about each of us getting the same amount. And equity really is about looking at systemic and root causes and looking at the fair distribution of resources. So I am excited to lead the effort to build a more transparent and open government that is leading with racial equity and is infusing equity in all of our programming, our policies, our investment of resources in communities. And I think the second part is really looking at how do we go about doing things differently? And this influences everything from the way that we do outreach to communities, to how we hire, to how we train our staff, to how we build teams, to how our programs are built, where our dollars are invested. All of these need to be examined. And I think at the port, we're going to be looking at a lot of models of how equity is infused in all of the aspects of the culture. The Office of Equity has made a very intentional choice of leading with race. And of course, when we look at the data, we see that we have a lot of work to do. So saying that we are going to lead with race does not mean that we are in any way not looking at how to build a cultural belonging and welcoming of all populations. But it does mean that the historical oppression and inequities towards people of color in this country needs to be centered. We really believe that we must keep an eye on the inequities that we're trying to solve. Our vision is that ultimately this government, the Port of Seattle, mirrors our community in our commitment, in our representation, in our investment, and is a good partner with the community. When I first arrived here, I had a lot of conversations, and one of the things that I heard very often was that the port was an unknown entity. So my commitment is to continue to become more and more transparent and to be in engagement with community partners, including government partners, to build, find ways for us to collaborate, to be at the table, and to invite more people inside the Port of Seattle.